Good morning, students. On today's lecture, I'll cover trigonometric ratios and sine and cosine rule. This is a little advanced than whatever we have done before. It's not very simple one. Uh, it has a bearing. It has a sine rule, cosine rule, and sometimes trigonometric ratios as well. Okay. And the first one uh, we have that the the math in this math, I have this. The diagram shows this diagram shows the positions of three places A, B, and C. The bearing of C from A, C from A is 45 degree. And uh, the, the bearing of C from A, C from A is 45 degree and C from B is 15 degree respectively. The point P is on AC, on AC due to north, north of B. Given that AB equal to BC, so just mark that AB equal to BC. Okay, they, they are 20, 20 kilometer, 20 kilometer, 20 kilometer each. What, whatever the information is given, write it down. And the bearing of B from A, B from A is 75. So this whole thing is 75. So I, since this is an isosceles triangle, whatever angle is here, this angle is here. So let's calculate this angle. This whole thing, the bearing of this one, from here to here is 75, and up to here is 45. So this angle, angle, C, A, B supposed to be 75 minus 45. That's going to be 30 degrees. So this is 30 degree. And that makes this one 30 degree as well. Since this is an isosceles triangle. Isosceles triangle means two side equal. And when this two side equal, that means their opposite sides, opposite angles are equal as well. So these are the information given. The distance of B from line AC. B from line AC. Whenever this distance is, uh, they talk about, that means always perpendicular distance, okay? So just do this, this perpendicular distance. They are always asking for this perpendicular distance. Let's name this X, okay? So we are trying to find out this BX. Now this does look like a right angle triangle and trigonometric ratio, I have angle and one side. So I can use that, uh, so ka tua, so ka tua. And this is gonna be oppo by hypo, so we're gonna use the sine oppo over hypo. So sine 30 degree equal to bx by ab, that's 20 degree. Therefore bx equal to 20 times sine 30. And sine 30 equal to half, but you can use the calculator. Sine 30 is gonna be a half times 20, that's mean 10, 10 kilometer. So the distance of B from AC, the shortest distance, that's gonna be 10 kilometer. All right, now next one is the length of AC. Now length of AC. Now I have this, I have that, okay. What else do I have? Now I can easily get this, this angle, angle B over here, the whole angle, because I know this is 30, this is 30, so this angle supposed to be, this angle B, angle, a, B, C is going to be 180 minus 30 plus 30, and that's going to be 180 minus 60, 120. So when I have two sides and included angle, I can use cosine rule. I hope you remember that. Cosine rule is when I have two sides and included angle, see this two sides and included angle is 120, I can use cosine rule to get that. So this AC is supposed to be square root 20 square plus 20 square minus two times 20 times 20 times cos 120 degree. So what do I got here? Uh, 20 square plus 20 square minus two times 20 times 20 times cos 120 degree and a square root 1200. That's gonna give me 20 root three or that's gonna be 34.6 kilometer. So this AC equal to 34.6 kilometer. The length BP, I need to find out this length BP. Now there are so many ways you can do this. Uh, if, if you look closely like this, see that BPC, this is 30 degree, okay? And this is your 15 degree. And I have this 20, I need BP. So, uh, two angles and one side is given, 
two angles and one side when we have two angles and one side we are gonna use sine rule okay now see I need this BP I need this length so opposite of that but this one uh, is not opposite of this so I need to calculate this angle here what is this angle okay sum of three angles of a triangle is 180 degrees so this angle over here BPC angle equal to 180 minus 15 plus 30 okay so that's gonna give me 180 minus 15 minus 30 that's gonna give me 135 degree so this is 135 now we are ready to do so BP BP equal to B, BP over uh, BP over sine 30 sine 30 and then I have 20 over sine 135 so BP equal to 20 times sine 30 over sine 135 so that's gonna be 20 times sine uh, sine 30 that's that divided by sine 135 and I got 10 root 2 or it's actually 14.1 kilometer okay this is a math you're gonna uh, come along with where you, you can use the trigonometry ratio you have to use sine rule cosine rule and you have bearing this is a very common math in O level exam okay hopefully you understand that if you have any question leave it in the comment box i'll get back to you thank you have a good day